Divine Fe Hi and welcome. We are in transmutation. We're transmuting negative energy and you feel it coming down through your body and you let, let it go out through your feet. So if you've been feeling agitated, anxious, intense energy, you're transmuting it because you're a transformer. Yes, you are. You're transforming the yuck yuck into light. I just got goosebumps then. So welcome whoever's joined us. I'm Bella Katrina and I'm here to bring you some guidance, healing and messages. I'm filled with the Holy Spirit and I offer that to you at Holy Holy Holy. It's on the extension below. I've changed the format of these readings. I'm going to bring you messages from um, your Lord and Saviour, the Romance Angels, Twin Flame Reiki Angels, because I teach Reiki as well. And um, also we're going to do a decree and we're going to declare. And hi there, love it when you say hi. And just let me know in the comments your name and your location. The light has changed significantly here. So I hope you can see and hear me okay. We're bringing in for the Twin Flame Collective a little bit of healing. So welcome Divine Masculine and Divine Feminine. I'm bringing you in Reiki symbols and it's up to you to receive them. Cherise from Queens in New York, welcome. Chuz, Carver, Texas. Donna from California. You're amazing. Ebony from Pittsburgh. I want to tell you, you're amazing. Hello, Angie. Welcome. You are doing it. You're on your mission and you're doing it. So it's, it's no more waiting. This is it. It wouldn't be a mission if it wasn't. Brenda from Tennessee, welcome. Thank you for being here. I'm changing the format and I'm going to actually, ex ex I'm going to share your extension here. So what I'm going to do, hi from South Australia, Kelly. So I'd love to know your name and where you're from. I'm Bella Katrina from Sydney, Australia. I'm going to bring you messages from the Lucy Cavendish Tarot. We're going to do a decree here. We're going to do Romance Angels, see what um, is going on for the Twin Flame Collective and the Divine Feminine aspect of that collective. Also, changing the format means that um, I'm going to include your extension here. So Christine from Pittsburgh, welcome. Hi, Kelly. And Mariana from Melbourne, Adelaide. Oh, Annabella. So what that means is your extension is included here. I'm not putting it on Vimeo as an extension. I, the messages have been so profound and God's shown me that everybody needs to get the messages. So I'm going to ask you to donate, which is hard for me to receive. So you're helping me. If you find this helps in any way or if you would like to give, we're giving for the collective so that we can all get the messages. So I hope that resonates with you and that um, you can give generously here at the chat on live or I'll put a PayPal me link right below if you feel that this has helped in any way so hi Sharisa what a beautiful name so we're just going to take a big deep breath I've got a few messages for you I'm going to spend a little bit more time here as I said I'm going to include your extension here and ask for donations so that we don't go to Vimeo for extensions only for receptive mode holy 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 and your soulmate Reiki because there's three things that um, I'm going to remind you that work for the twin flame journey and the first one is releasing the Jezebel spirit taking the Holy Spirit the second one is getting out of the mind matrix and the third one is declaring and decreeing that you're safe and that you're a child of God so we're going to do all those things for you so I started with the transmutation goes through your body and you feel it as in angst agitation or energy do you know what I mean so anchor it down I had to anchor it through the last month has been very intense especially for divine feminine because I used to think that the twin flames right the masculine could bring it and I'm being gender specific if you don't mind and the cards are gender specific. So Jezebel talks about non-gender specific. Here at Bella Katrina, we're gender specific because I'm a female, I'm not a male. Of course I have the divine energy, right, of both. But I'm not both. I'm a female. So when you look at the tarot, the king of cups is a king. It's not a female. That's not... Anyway, 
I'll leave that alone. And I'm going to tune into the collective here, bringing you messages and guidance. Included here is your extension, right? So everybody can receive it. And now I'm going to rely on your bookings with me personally for your free upgrade in your Shabam and also your attunements and donations because, you know, you're helping me receive when you give. So this has popped out. Your first message is caring for your self-divine feminine. Welcome, Astara Blu-ray from New Jersey. The blue rays are on it. So what we're really finding out here is that it's our due diligence to look after ourselves. It takes the pressure off your twin because they have to look after themselves. So what I thought is we both had to connect to the divine and bring it through our heart chakra, but really it's the divine feminine bringing it because love does. I was like, Jesus, you're kidding. You could have told me a bit earlier. So divine love isn't here. So how can you resent your parents for not bringing you something that they didn't have to bring, right? It's a matrix um, on your trauma. So we're breaking free of that. And I'm here to tell you that you're amazing and that you're doing it even though you think you're not, just by being here and thinking, how can I make myself happy today? It's my responsibility to clear my heart and my mind. And here is your first card out, caring for yourself. So this is about also um, allowing sunlight into your crown chakra and the retina of your eye. So when you wear sunglasses, oh, thank you, Goddess Queen. Welcome. I love, I love, I'm trying to receive, see. Thank you for your donation. I really appreciate it. Um, so you're helping the collective so that we all get the extension, if that makes sense. So when you're caring for yourself, I'm just getting a low iodine level. I'm a Reiki master, energetic healer. We're going to have a snapshot here of the energy. We're going into the romance angel, seeing what's coming up for twin flames and also getting messages from um, your Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. If you haven't received him, go to holy, holy, holy on the link below. I'll put it there. We're going to have your extension included in this reading. So thank you for being here. Eight of Swords is caring for yourself. I get low um, iodine level, so you could be a bit of anemic. Um, and also, um, thank you, Goddess Queen. Hi, Champagne. Champagne. Um, you get it in, it's low iron. It makes you feel listless, you know, couldn't care less. I am done with this whole mission, right? So forget the mission, forget your twin and look after yourself. And then your twin has to, because of the energy, it's like a mirror. Thank you, Mariana, Theodore, for your donation. So we're giving here so we can give the extension to the whole collective. So thank you very much. If you're not here live, please, um, you can donate if you feel like you want to at my PayPal me button and I'll have to put it up. So let me just do a snapshot of the energy of divine feminine twin flames. So we all can tune into this collective and all take it because we're, we're bringing divine love to somewhere that it doesn't exist. Okay, so that's why it's hard. But the dark cannot overcome it oh just got goosebumps we call on the father the son and the holy spirit we also have the galactic beings of light i have met the palladians because i'm a blue ray twin flame and we also have the venus beings of light okay okay i'm saying okay we're going to do a few things because i need your power and you know that when we do these dec declarations and decrees the fireworks go off in heaven. Now, when you, excuse me, receive the Holy Spirit, you light up like Casper the ghost. The Palladian said we light up. So congratulations to those of you who've booked your free upgrade with me because you get the blessing in your reading. So you can have a private extension and you book that at ReikiBibella.com. I'm back. Purposeful action. So we're going to find out what Divine Feminine needs to do because that was my question. Let's tell us what we need to do, God. What is the action that we need to do? So I'm going to use Lucy Cavendish Tarot and they're the bright colours. And yes, I do tarot in the name of Jesus Christ. And it's working. So please don't question it. Okay. Oh, because I did the Holy Communion video. Those of you who've received the Holy Spirit, congratulations, you take communion, nothing's more powerful. And then I got all the Christians, you know, so-called Christians. So I'm not, I don't have a religion. God doesn't have a religion as far as I'm concerned. He is just God and we're his children. And you being here is enough, right? You're here. 
It's when I put my hands up one day and I was like, God, I got here, I used to say to my boss. I got dressed, got up and got here. Like, you know, no meetings. <laughs> like, what else can you expect? Just let me have my coffee. So that's what it's like with God. It's like, I got here. You're here. You're ground crew. Right. If you're not asking for um, hi, Christine, welcome for help. Right. Then they can't intervene. I was upset once with the Palladians. I was crying, saying, I'm sorry, I have to ask for more help. I don't know. I feel lost. I feel alone and lonely. And they started laughing. We have kookaburras in Australia and they come in as birds, kookaburras. And so they were laughing at me. I was like, why are they laughing at me? Because that's ridiculous. So why is that ridiculous? What was I saying? And I said, you're asking for help. If you don't ask, we can't intervene. Therefore, we are superfluous. Another new word for Bella. Twin flame snapshot. Okay? In the past, we've been dreaming of this change. We've been creating it, right? From two years ago, three years ago, creating something that doesn't exist. So you've been creating it. And in the next four weeks, it's about to manifest. However, if you see that you ordered a Ferrari, for instance, and you look in the um, garage and there's a mini moak, <laughs> mini minor, you're like, can you change the mini minor into a Ferrari? No. But how many people try to go into the matrix and change it? Once it's turned up in 3D, that's it. So you either receive it or you say no to that and you send it back and you go, sorry, I ordered a Ferrari. I'm going to say no to the Mini. I'm not going to try and change the Mini into a Ferrari because that's where we get lost in the matrix. So the next four weeks are really powerful for Twin Flames. I know we've been through so much and how hard has it been and how lost have you felt and how alone and how disgusting. From the Bronx, Carly, welcome. From the Bronx in New York, so good to have you here. So the next four weeks is really counting on you to stay in receptive mode. Now I put a link, I'll put a link below for receptive mode because we're into receiving, not needing. We've put the order in the GPS, right? We're gonna do a declaration in a minute to secure that. Then you gotta sit back and follow your intuitive guidance and that comes through your clairs. You hear, see, think and feel. So when you are, like when we were younger, we were taught to not be so sensitive. You know, but now your sensitivity is going to work for you and not against you. As long as you're grounded and protected, release the Jezebel spirit, take the Holy Spirit and also get out of the mind matrix. I teach Reiki to do that because I found that that works for me and it would work for you. So you can book that at ReikiByBella.com, level one, two and three. It's amazing, changes your life. So underneath here is a resurgence of the dream because we got lost, we didn't think it was going to happen and it didn't turn up the way we thought it's like that's a mini <laughs> we ordered a ferrari so you got to go back to god not into the matrix and change it okay so the outcome here i'm just going to show you straight away the outcome is balance is restored in this union and enjoying the outcome I also get that, you know, sunlight is very important. I was telling you that before. It comes in through your crown and the retina of your eye. So sunglasses were made to block it out and hats. And there was a thing in Australia, slip, slop, slap. It's actually satanic because it cuts out the light. And you are light, so you need to connect to light. So people have reported that they look into the sun. Now, when I was younger, mum said, don't look into the sun, you could go blind. It's like, that is untrue. You can get a lot of nutrition from the sun and you need to connect and you look through, look directly at the sun. So it's called sun gazing and it makes you feel amazing. So everything we've been taught, really, it's like the inverted opposite of that, if you can imagine. That's why it's been so hard. So in the past three weeks, the dream right has crumbled and you're going to recharge your hopes for the future here right recharging your hopes i'm including your extension here because i'm relying on um donations if you so feel inclined you can do live chat here or you can do paypal me god's saying i have to ask 
So here is stress, anxiety, worry, doubt and fear. This is illegal. In the fifth dimension, it doesn't happen. In the fifth dimension, which is heaven, what we think about, we create straight away. That's why it's so slow down here. The energy is so dense. And also it's got to go through your chakra system, right? That's how we create. That's why the transmutation was here. So when you feel the angst, that's good because you're letting that go. So when you bring love in, everything not of love has to disappear. So there's something really nice coming in. You're getting a blessing from the divine, if you like. Because look, this is the outcome for the April for the divine feminine. Hello from Philadelphia, living in Japan, Jonah, welcome. So this is Divine Feminine, right, taking your power back and saying, I'll have that order, thanks. I ordered a Ferrari, not a Mini Moak. I didn't order a third party situation. I'm going to send that back. So then I'm making it a third party. So I'm going to not make it a third party and let whoever that is just fall into that third party and see how long they last. Good, Christine. Look at my... Um, get out of the mind, unplug from the mind matrix, third eye Reiki transmission. Because when you get out of the mind matrix, this is your third eye, you get DMT released in here and this is where you connect to source, to your creator, to God. I, I did it and it happened. So everything you hear about the third eye is satanically inverted opposite information. No one tells you God's there. No one tells you. Cindy Marshall, welcome from Canada. This is divine feminine energy, right? So this is a balance restored. This is, uh, yes, I forgive you because we're going to ignore bad behavior and we're going to reward good behavior, right? Just like a parent would. Well, not ours so much. So 3D is dense. We're bringing a vibration down into the darkness and the darkness cannot overcome it. Love is 6,000 times more powerful than fear, but you wouldn't think so because we're tricked in the matrix from the Stephanie from Canada. Welcome, Stargirl, from the trauma that's been set up from the last three generations of narcissistic abuse. You're breaking it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So it's not easy. Okay, it's not easy because... I'm going to include your extension here. Sorry, they're just talking to me. The purposeful action. I'm just going to do a snapshot on that, a little reading on that, because the next week you're going to be, um, I hate saying that, tested, right? It's testing. Are you going to go into the Matrix and try and change the Mini into a, into a Ferrari or are you going to go out and go say no to that because silence is consent and then you're going to bring it down. So the Palladians, God, Jesus, all the Romance Angels, Archangel Michael, Uriel, Gabriel, all the Ascended Masters cannot intervene because they uphold this law, the universal law of free will. So even though Divine Masculine... <laughs> picking on him has free will god's on our side right so um <laughs> you've been in the dance party yes when your third eye opens you get dmt released and that's a hallucinogenic natural chemical because um i'm just going to tell you quickly fluoride in the water calcifies it um, there is wi-fi calcifies this and kills your eggs and your sperm it's designed for that that's why it's called a laptop so the laptop actually kills that's why anyway turn your wi-fi off at night to take your cellular phone away from your children how many times oh wow lioness thank you so much for your donation i'm relying on donation here by the way so you can do it here or you can do paypal me if you want to so that we can all receive the extensions i love you so much i can feel your love just know that you're not alone and that whatever you're going through is actually the pressure that creates a diamond. So, I mean, people say, oh, even my twin flame was like, oh, you're so bright. It's like I had to get this bright because you were so dark. <laughs> it's actually your fault. So if you look into the matrix, meaning if you're looking to your twin to get you something, it's like they don't have it. you got to connect. You're the acupuncture point. So the first thing I did is connect to Gaia, to the earth. Then I went up to the 12th dimension and found source. And then I got out of the mind matrix and brought it down here, opened my third eye, cleared my heart, and then Jesus comes through your heart and actually sits in your solar plexus, right? That's how it happens. So God really does send his son. We're looking at the purposeful action for divine feminine energy of the twin flame collective. 
What is the purpose for action? I'm just going to pull three cards for that. Yeah, see? Death to the pain and trauma in your heart so that you can take your clothes off, for goodness sake. <laughs> I don't think we have any clothes in heaven. Anyway, that's what's happening. All the pain is going. It's been massive, intense. And what happens is the matrix can keep you there. The mind matrix. Thank you. Hi from Washington. And curly locks. Isn't she cute? The pain. It's trauma-based mind control. So when we release the trauma, the mind control has no power over you. And that's why I harp on about it. And the best way i found it is to get rid of Jezebel, take the Holy Spirit. That's why I put holy, 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 and I walk you through it. And exactly what happened for me, right? I did it on my own. God is not a religion. It's no religion here. It's just you and God. So I was like, I am malfunctioning and I have to go back to my creator with my warranty. <laughs> Jesus, because I was malfunctioning. So this is what's happened. The unexpected revelation, right? The unexpected third party, the unexpected because divine masculine is a sheep in wolf's clothing. That's why it's hard to decipher. The narcissist comes in and plays around. Jezebel spirit, if you get divine feminine off track then we don't have to worry about divine masculine he's already got the jezebel spirit because it's come from his mother and their mother and their mother so thank you so much for um connecting here thanks curly locks so this has been painful this has been a shock to the system this has been like do you know what i mean like whoa and then you get back to zero point because as if Lucifer can actually make me get out of my mission because of some other third party, because of some matrix program, right? I'm going to blast it with love. 6,000 times more powerful than fear is love. So the purposeful action is to clear your heart of the trauma so you're not in the mind control program. Therefore, a narcissist doesn't relate to Reiki life force or love the vibration of love so if you bring love then they disappear you don't have to worry about it but normally we go out of ourselves go in there and we try to change the mini into a ferrari the narcissist into divine masculine it's none of your business you just bring love to it and you see who disappears and who comes in and what happens is you bring it to your divine masculine and the wolf disappears Yes, get Reiki from me soon. Level one, two, and three. Level one is for physical. Level two is emotional and mental. It helps you because it stops people draining you and dumping on you. Changed my life. And then you actually align with your life purpose. And then when you get to mastership, you get your spiritual wings. We need it because of the matrix. And that's the thing that happens. So if you're going to join me now, thanks so much for being here. Pascal from Nebraska, welcome. We're going to do a dynamic decree and it's the last thing I feel like doing. <laughs> so you're making me do it. But it is a dynamic decree for twin flames. And I'm just going to ask that you say it either out loud or silently in your head. It only takes a minute. I put my hand in the air. I don't know why. But we're just going to call in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Hello, Denise from New Jersey. Welcome. Thank you for being here. I can feel your love. And I just want you to know that you're not alone. No matter how painful it is, right? As soon as you get the Holy Spirit and you take Jesus as your Lord and Savior, they start building a mansion for you. So then you don't worry about money so much, about your mortgage, about, you know, what you give your life force to each day, your job, like you're giving your life force. Divine Masculine mainly is giving his life force to the patriarchal belief that if I hold the keys to the home, then I am the boss, it's like, well, Divine Feminine doesn't really want the keys to the house. She wants your heart and soul. So we give it to Jesus first and then we bring the vibration of love to Divine Masculine. He lights up and brings it back and creates the infinity symbol. So we're just going to say, in the name of the Christ, I call to the blessed I am presence of my twin flame for the sealing of our hearts as one, for the victory of our mission to humanity. I invoke the light of the Holy Spirit for the consuming of all negative karma, limiting the expression of our divine identity and the fulfillment of our divine plan. 
We ask the ego to come crashing down, making way for soul truths. We also call upon Jesus, the divine healer, to heal the wounds of the past and to repair the wounded tissue. And we ask for this in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. So the heartache, the pain is actually making way for more love. So I thank you for going through it. All right, that was huge, big energy. I'm also going to decree some um, favor over your life, speak some favor over your life. Okay, I'm going to leave that, they said. They, the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. We've got Jesus Christ here. That's the revelation, by the way. The revelation is that Jesus is the way, the truth and the light because we're in the dark. So if you're um, wanting to receive your spiritual gifts, you can go to Holy, Holy, Holy and receive the Holy Spirit and then you can do um, communion with me. There's nothing more powerful than communion. The way I found all this was through Reiki though, I must say, and through going into the darkness. Thank you. Is that Sharon? Welcome. So um, I'm, whoa, whoa, whoa. Flew out. This one. Fear not, little flock, for it is your father's good pleasure to give you the kingdom. Luke 12, 52. The kingdom, you're getting a mansion made in the kingdom. I've been to the second heaven and seen the palace calls them mansions my father's mansions has many rooms in the mansion just going to tell you quickly was the two angels they record everything that you think and everything that you do your actions so if you get on your knees and you pray they record that and that puts oil in your lamp there was this beautiful big green lamp in the middle of the room and I was going Jesus what's that he goes that's your lamp and when you pray and when you worship and when you send love you get oil in your lamp and they keep a record of it there's record keeping angels it's like oh I didn't know that because <laughs> I was like I don't break any commandments I don't need to confess I'm not Catholic I don't have any religion and then it was like okay what I realized is that when you gossip or when you have doubt or fear or the trauma it opens doorways to demons and then Lucifer has power over you so I was sitting with my twin once and we're talking about what's your biggest weakness so I want you to look at your weakness and how it's used against you and so mine was food right and how I sabotaged myself with sugar and so what I realized is that all of us are being sabotaged by the food because how do you humble yourself before the father he asks you to fast why because of the food now you will say oh I don't think so but let me tell you the most disgusting things in food you've got to watch it people have been onto this for years I'm just getting it so we're just asking for you if you've got any questions right just ask here because we're all together so another message from Jesus I am the good shepherd the good shepherd giveth his life for the sheep he gave his life for you so you don't have to we're going to ascend we don't go through the death portal isn't that awesome however the inverted opposite is Lucifer he commands blood sacrifice Woo! thank you pure love 499 for your 499 i love you i'm going to connect into the romance angels the reason i'm doing this is to include your extension here i do have receptive mode which is backstage with bell uncut if you would like to learn how to get into more of receptive mode because divine feminine we've had to be in 80 percent giving to get here we've had to get into the masculine initiating energy right to thank you um to survive it's been survival and now we have to get into 80 percent 75 percent receptive mode so t soulmates are different they're 50 50 twin flames are 75 percent receptive mode. when you do that divine masculine can become vulnerable and can actually release and heal that 25 percent of feminine energy that's based on the last three generations so you're breaking genetic coding oh before we do this yeah before we do the romance angels can we just do a decree here we're going to ask for all the light tribe the um palladian galactics i call them palladian angels of light 
So if you need discernment, you just say only 100% light, only 100% light, only 100% light. Because if you don't ask, they can't intervene, which was my, my story I was telling you. Okay, so we're just going to call in our light tribe. And we're going to ask for the Stargate template to manifest, divine consci consciousness. Allow us to amplify during these gateways and open through our human new reality. So you're becoming a angelic human, not a satanic human, a transhuman. A transhumanism is what's coming in. It changes your DNA. When you receive the Holy Spirit, your DNA changes. You get light in your DNA. When you receive the mark of the beast, you receive the triple helix DNA, which changes your vibration. So therefore, God can't intervene after that. Right, so this, that's the warning. And they've started giving permission slips at kindergartens for children to have the mark of the beast. And if you're in the matrix, go, oh, that sounds good. My dog has a microchip. So if my child ever got lost or anything happened, I'd be able to find them. Like it sounds good in the, re in, you know, but that's why I'm here to tell you, get out of the matrix, connect to your heart and the vibration of truth and love reigns supreme. We are embodying and calling in the new template. You are the way shower of embodiment of the pure crystalline consciousness. It is necessary for this timeline shift and it's the highest vibration to ever be on the planet. The divine is asking you to draw, write, sing and dance to actually expand this vibration so we're going to do another command so powerful it goosebumps all over me i command and decree the final effortless removal of all lower timelines programs thought forms entities deities and beings which control and manipulate humanity gaia kingdoms and elementals in a negative way i command all which interfere with the ascension anything blocking the progression of humanity to now cease and desist progression and I say in the mighty name of Jesus Christ bind all uncomplimentary creations and take them back to source never ever to return oh, got goosebumps again so what I'm going to do is a romance reading from now until you know it's really April my new um, format is that I'm including your extension here. So these readings go a little bit longer. So, you know, there's so many readers on YouTube, so many divine feminines, beautiful healing lights coming out. Also, there's a lot with Jezebel spirit. So the I had to I just have to do something a little bit different for you so that you can receive some healing and so that you have your extensions to go to of holy, holy, holy to receive the Holy Spirit, create your sword of light. The angels take the sword and fight the demons with it. I didn't know that. And how do you create it? By saying the word once you have the Holy Spirit. So many things that you learn through the Holy Spirit. We want some romance. Somebody said to me, why worry about that twin flame relationship anymore? I said, that's the only thing to worry about. Because that's the mission, is to prepare your heart to bring romance and love somewhere that it doesn't exist. Whoa. Flying around and flying around. Then we're going to get a message from your twin. Ha! Huh, that fell out. So that's what you're doing. You're freeing yourself from the old mental programming of worry, doubt and fear and just changing it. Control, alt, delete. Do you love it? Cancel, clear, delete that thought. If you've got a frown, or I'm grinding my teeth. I go cancel, clear, delete. What am I thinking? I'm going to change that. And you say an affirmation every morning. The Palladians say every morning you get up, you got to say, I declare I am safe. I was like, but what? Well, no, 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 shut up, Bella. Just say it. I'm like, okay. Romance Angels, we call upon you now. Okay, so they're going to ask, they're asking me to say something. This is why I'm doing this longer and relying on more of your um, donations either on live chat or at PayPal me because I'm going to bring healing in as well just to bring something different because there's so many readers and sometimes you can get like, you know, I was watching one, I was crying after it. I thought, oh, that reader is in pain. So I'm picking up her pain. <laughs> the fairies are here. So a lot of you are elementals as well, can tap into the elemental kingdom, releasing your ex. So... Don't get hooked up on labels. That's my twin, that's my twin. We're just bringing love and we'll see who turns up. 
So your twin flame is a sheep in wolf's clothing. So you're never going to get it if you're in the trauma. And that's the code of dependency. So <clears throat> you felt unrequited love in the past. We all know what that feels like. That means that the wolf is there. You can't find the sheep. The love. The sheep. Here it comes. Right? The chemistry. God's already put it in the seed. You're the, you know, the star seed. <clears throat> Just getting a bit of agitation. Somebody's joined us. Wow. Releasing things. So it's safe this time around. Right? It's going to be safe. It is safe for me to love and be loved. Because the programming is like it's not safe. Right? Getting to know yourself. It's also about how to talk about yourself and how to ask and request what you need. So the energy coming out here is um, the angel. Look at the angel wings. And this is the hopes and fears, but you know that it pulls at your solar plexus, right? Pulls at your power center if it's not good. And here comes the birth of new love. So you're birthing something in the darkness and the darkness cannot overcome it. So look underneath the codependency from the past life. Breaking that code, it goes back three generations. You have a key code lock in your DNA, that time to go off. Unbelievable. So it's safe for you to love and love, be loved. <coughs> Just tuning into that. Moving away from anything that no longer serves you. Moving away from not receiving, right? So you've got to get out of the needing. Codependency is needing and that's unrequited love. That pushes away. We're going to get into receptive mode and that's receiving, not needing because there's a new birth of love happening in the mas divine masculine energy and it's happening because of divine feminines purging and transmutating all that energy we're going to get a message from your divine masculine from the tony carmine salerno cards you are always in my heart like a glowing ocean light a shimmering star in heaven love is a golden memory drifting through space like autumn leaves Recollections of loving days and nights. I've been gardening. Don't look at my nails. I'm going to get another message from Divine Masculine to Divine Feminine. Let us be the love we seek. Let us be the change we wish to see. Let us give freely to one another without condition, for it is giving that we receive. I hardly stand it. <laughs> I'm going to ask you to join me now. And saying some decrees. I declare I am unique and special. I am extraordinarily and custom made, one of a kind. Of all the things God created, what he is the most proud of is me. I am God's masterpiece, his most prized possession. I will keep my head held high, knowing I am a child of the Most High God, made in his very image. I declare I will use my words to bless people. I will speak favour and victory over my family, friends and loved ones. I will help call out their seeds of greatness by telling them, I am proud of you. I love you. Oh, I'm emotional. You are amazing. You are talented. Oh. Excuse me. You are beautiful. You will do great things in this life. I declare unexpected blessings are coming my way. I will move forward from barely making it to having more than enough. God will open up supernatural doors for me. He will speak to the right people about me. I will see Ephesians 3.20 exceedingly abundantly above and beyond favour and increase in my life. Because I honour him, his blessings will chase me down and overtake me. I will be in the right place at the right time. Oh, people will go out of their way to be good to me. I am surrounded by God's favour. I don't know why I'm emotional. Because sometimes we just feel so lost. We're receiving a divine visitation, I think, right now. By the Father. Whoever wants to save his life will lose it. 
But whoever loses his life because of me will find it. Matthew sixteen twenty five. <clears throat> Excuse me. Just going to call upon the Holy Spirit for the extension now. I'm feeling you, Missy. I'm feeling you, Missy Lynn. I'm feeling your love that is being poured in. It's beautiful. Something amazing happening here. I don't know, I don't know what. <laughs> but I just got a donation. <laughs> Thank you. Jamia, is it? Thank you for your $5 donation. I love you. I'm going to cry together. God said, if you have to cry and say it, cry and say it. Oh, making me emotional. It's all your fault. Let's have a look. What does Divine Feminine need to know right now? Oh, forgiveness. So I was like, I already forgive you for the next dumb thing you're going to do. <laughs> and then it was like, you're a bleep. And then, but I am forgiveness. So I am forgiveness, I keep saying that, I am forgiveness itself. And Lucifer will try everything in 3D to make you think that is unforgivable, right? My mum used to say, oh, that's unforgivable. It's like, what was that? Oh, yeah, don't forgive them. It's like, yeah, whatever you do, it's unbreakable between flame bond. Do you understand? Oh, 199, thank you. I love you. Thank you for your donation. I'm asking for Super Chat here, but you can also give at PayPal me. I'm going to put the button below later. But I'm doing your extensions here so that we can all get it, so the collective can all get it because they've been so powerful and I look and only a few get it and I think, oh, it takes so long to upload it. Give it to everybody and then whoever would like to donate can donate and then we help each other, aren't we? So let's have a look. I've got the, um, it's called the Mythic Tarot and I'm doing tarot readings in the name of Jesus Christ. <laughs> Sorry, I think that's funny. So, oh, I mean, I think it's funny how people say you can't do that. Yay! So what that shows me, right, is divine feminine. We know divine masculine has a huge ego. So what we're going to do is we're going to help that ego work for you and not against you. So how do you do that? I teach you at um, Twin Flame Receptive Mode, but I've learned it the hard way. So I'm bringing you stuff that I've proven, right? I'm not regurgitating somebody else's opinion. I'm sharing with you what I found that works and it's taken a long time to do it like to find out what works you know when you're on your own so I'm here to save you time thank you lioness so beautiful I can feel your hearts and just know that you're very special and that you know it matters when you're when you get upset but Tiki you have God dominion over your soul so you have God dominion at a soul level over your twin so that's why we don't go into the matrix and change the mini into a fro. We go back and we go, hang on, we're going to call down and decree. And um, so we're going to do it now. We're going to release something now. This is why I'm doing this donations instead of extensions. You can get your own extension. So if you would like to join me, you just put your hand up and you say, um, as I have God dominion over my soul. I know you have to have the Holy Spirit to, for this to work, to create. So if you haven't got it, go to Holy, Holy, Holy and get it because it's going to create so much power. And then you get your gift. Straight away you get a spiritual gift from the Holy Spirit. I demand and decree as I have God dominion over my soul to cast out any demons from my twin flame in the name of Jesus Christ. We ask by the blood of Jesus, we command Jezebel spirit to leave our twin in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You have no power over my twin. And we're now going to call on the holy angels to enforce the law of encroachment on our twin flame and release them from any low vibrations in the power and the glory of the Father. In the name of the Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Sorry, I'm looking at the Father. I've got a picture of him I'm going to show you in a minute. Anything else? starts a new beginning the fool just fell out am I being a fool let's have a look I use the tarot right because it's a tool 
It has no power. I am reading right the energy that I'm putting into it. So well done for casting things out. Please get the Holy Spirit because you need to have the gifts. <clears throat> we get the superpowers and gifts. So let's have a look from April. So the full moon's coming up. We just went through something massive, right? The total lunar eclipse, a spring equinox, and a super blood moon. I mean, hello. No wonder you feel sick a little bit. And no wonder, you know, maybe your twin's acting out or karmics have come in to clear. So you've got to back out because you don't want to make it a third-party situation. That's none of your business. Obviously, that's not cooked yet. We're going to put that back in the oven and we go to the holy angels to call an encroachment. <laughs> hear snoring in this car <laughs> sorry thank you donna for your 199 <laughs> i appreciate your energy ace of swords is underneath what is twin flame receptive mode oh well that's instead of needing right it's codependency is needing attention we go into receptive mode so we're receiving so it's different because we, all our lives we've had to go into initiation to get here and now we want to receive the Holy Spirit, receive the love of God, receive. So receptive mode, I made a, um, a playlist on Vimeo. It's a subscription and I go in there and update it and you've got Bella Uncut to teach you all about it. Love flows supreme. So what happens is divine feminine gets stoic right stoic means that you're not um overly full of feelings like gushing your feelings and you have no complaint so i remember doing this ages ago and i was like i was called upon to demonstrate it and in that demonstration it is kryptonite to superman so then divine masculine becomes more vulnerable right and allows his heart to open just going to do a snapshot here of what's coming up for April. See, Jezebel's out and about, right? Just before twin flames coming together, it's all out massive action on the dark side. If you were working for the dark side, who would you take down first? You'd take the one who has the highest vibration in the generator. Your heart has the highest volume to generate, right? The vibration of love. So then you had the biggest bucket. So then you have the most pain. So it seems like it goes on forever, but I'm telling you, it will. Yes, Carly, Curly Locks is here. So the Wheel of Fortune is turning things underneath, right? This is what you sow, you reap. So what you've put in before is coming back to you. There's a cycle here, but also um, these are the angels that watch what you do. So this might be your twin's karma. You've got to step out of the way and go, well, I've seen it happen. And I've had to step out of the way because that you've just created karma. What we're trying to do is not create more karma. We don't want to create karma. We're here to clear karma. So if your twin's creating karma, you need to get out of the way because that's going to flip back straight away. Karma comes back so quickly. In Time is speeding up. We're in a different phase of evolution, right? So here is... Oh. Okay. This is in the past, Ten of Wands, your burdens, putting them down, of worrying about how is this going to happen? How is this going to come together? The how-tos are none of your business. Just focus back on yourself, how to make yourself happy and love. And this is the energy right now, Seven of Wands, right? This is jealousy. This is um, Jezebel trying to take down and distract Divine Masculine. Jezebel can be in a loved one, can be in a child, can be in a family member. So I'm going to tell you now, I hold back on this stuff, but I'm not anymore. There's two initiations that I'm very aware of. The first one is the karmic cycle, the karmic. Maybe there's been seven lifetimes, 26,000 years of karma we're clearing. Hello, it's not easy. So if there's something that you took seven lifetimes and didn't clear, that person comes back, you have to do it now. God's pouring his spirit out upon you. It's going to happen. The whole of the universe is conspiring for this to clear and your soul came in to do it. So you've got to know that jealousy can come through. The second initiation is the DNA lineage, right? So it's um, because, I'm going to just share it with you. They call it monarch programming and they call that MK Ultra, right? So the de devil always does the inverted opposite, but they take it from the monarch butterfly that God created, takes three generations to do the migration. So in the 
then to come back is the memory. The memory is encoded in the DNA. Well, not that they have DNA, but do you know what I mean? So that's what happens here is you've been encoded with DNA from three lifetimes, three generations that you're breaking. So like it's not easy. Divine Masculine is in terror because he's breaking a code that his parents didn't break, his father didn't break, his mother didn't break. And it's like, you are a hero for even being here. And what we do is we put ourselves down and then our weakness comes in and d the devil uses it against you. So your weakness is what? What would be your top, one of your top weaknesses? Doing a session here with you. So give generously. So I said food. My twin said is temper. So when you temper, get tempered like this, you feed demons. They eat fear and anger. Can you believe that? Since CERN opened, there's been millions that have been released. Hello. Thank you for being here, Tracy, from Clearwater in Florida. Welcome. So I'm doing these longer readings because I'm bringing more healing and I'm asking for your support. This is your extension we're doing right now. So here is the jealousy, right? We're not fighting against flesh and blood. We're fighting against the demons. When CERN opened, it created the Mandela effect. I don't know how many of you are awake, but I'm just going to go there, okay? And also um, created... Um, the release of a lot of demonic activity. So they're like eight-year-old children. They're the size of an eight-year-old child, the demons, energetically. And they are like mangy dogs. So if silence is consent, just say you're a little child and a mangy dog comes up to a little child, they're not going to say get away. They're just going to pat out like silence is consent. So we do. And after a while, if a six or seven are allowed to stay with you, then they call in the hierarchy. And then if they're allowed to stay, it's like sending the sales pitch out, right? If somebody's allowed to stay, then they send out the hierarchy, then they send out the stronghold. And that's where you get the Holy Spirit. You speak in tongues. It breaks the stronghold in your area. So you're going to bloom where you are planted. And you're not going to engage in this because this is your weakness being used against you. So this is what Divine Mask and I see is being challenged because look, here's the lovers. So there's three Jezebels. Thank you, Curly Locks. Another donation. I really appreciate it. You're helping me receive. See, this is receptive mode because it's taken me so long to even ask. But you ask and you receive. So I really appreciate your support you're giving on behalf of the collective. So the lovers is in the future, which means it's going to choose love. Right? So looking at that, that's heartbreaking when you realize my mum didn't have love to give me and I'm resenting her for it. So there's easier to forgive. So there's a choice in love. So it's choosing at the moment to be single. Energetically. This is the single card, right? And this is a man. This is not a woman. So this is divine masculine. Do we understand? We're gender specific. God is gender specific. <laughs> and so this is really about divine masculine and divine feminine. But this is what they wanted to know. It's actually Herculean effort, right? This is energy transmuting it transfiguration it's anger being transmuted like the carbon dioxide transmuted into oxygen right so it's like taking the pain the struggle it's a herculean effort to say no to jezebel see jezebels three jezebels there so that could be uh wife daughter mother isn't that disgusting and there are three generations of it that you're breaking. So it can come up and do all the healing and then all of a sudden there's a DNA code lock that's timed to actually release. So it feels like it's like black dye releasing in your body. I, that's how I felt it. And then comes up the third one is your persecution energy from past lives. So it's like being, I got a pain here and I was laying on the ground howling because the pain was released in my body. You know, when people have scars or they have birthmarks, they say they're from past lives. And when you receive tattoos, a lot of times that it's because you were in that tribe in a past life. Don't know what that's come in for. Some of you must do that. So there's a Herculean effort. Tracy, thank you so much for your donations. Okay, 
I really appreciate it. So that the sword of truth comes down, right? The Excalibur sword has been received on the planet through Halloween. And that was where the indigos lit up. And this is fierce energy. So as soon as that happens, all the mangy dogs are sent out. So you've got to say no. Silence is consent. So all you do is you say, I say no, get back. I say, um, get away from me, Lucifer. <laughs> I am with the Lord thy God and I serve him only. So now my sensitivity, which is what I want you to take on, is your sensitivity. When you get agitated, just go, good point, Lucifer. Instead of going into the matrix and yelling and using your temper or going to chocolate and eating, right? I go to worship because it's like now my sensitivity is working for me. Every time I get agitated, I go, I need to pray. I get on my knees or I worship or I do holy fire. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to do holy fire. In the name of Jesus Christ, I now stir up, activate and release. Holy fire, holy fire, holy fire. When you receive the Holy Spirit, Jesus baptizes you with holy fire. Now, I did it in the ocean the other day and a whale came out and it's like, I didn't even get it. And a lady, we're doing paddling, you know, kayaking. And she said, that happened because of you. And then when I got home, I was like, why did she say that to me, Jesus? And he goes, because remember you did the holy fire? I was like, I forget I do these things. So nature, if you just sat there in nature, got grounded and present and did holy fire all day, that would be your mission. God will bring you everything. All manner comes from heaven. Let's have another snapshot here. And then I'm going to close with a lovely message. Curly locks, you need to receive the Holy Spirit at holy, holy, holy. I'll put the link below. And um, otherwise you're, you're, um, you're not safe. We're just doing a final snapshot here. Let's have a look. For just divine feminine God. We've been so weak and so lonely and we're wanting support. It just seems so hard at times. But God's already won. We've already won. So let's have a look. I'm using the Rider Weight, which is the original tarot. Just like Reiki, I did the original Yusui Tibetan method. If you would like to become um, charged with Reiki and you can use your hands for healing, look at my website, reikibybella.com. This is a snapshot for the divine feminine receptive mode. Greetings from New York. Curly locks, not through me, not through Jesus. So if you've received the Holy Spirit, tell me what's your spiritual gift you received. I don't feel it, that's all, so may want to do it again. Okay, getting itchy nose, which means all the fairies are about and they're real. I've actually seen fairies, so don't worry. Elemental kingdom is real. Underneath is death, letting go of the old, right? This is a rebirth for the divine feminine again. We're rebirthing again. So you've got the sun, the ace of wands, the page of cups, the empress. So beautiful. What a beautiful finale. Sorry, my nose is itchy because of this, because you purged all this. And just know that, okay, another message is through your energy field, through the month, it changes, right? So sometimes you're bulletproof. Sometimes you're like this because it's PMT time, right? See the astrological signs? It's the time of the month. Men have it too. We all do. The cycle of the moon. So you want to get into co-creating with the universe, excuse me, because you're going to know that sometimes, so good to see you live, D. So sometimes, um, how would people know whether you're in this um, this energy as opposed to bulletproof? Because sometimes in the month you're bulletproof, sometimes you're very sensitive and sometimes you're like, oh, you know, you're highly creative or weak. So there's only one more week where you're sort of normal. <laughs> so you might have codes for yourself. You go, oh, I'm a bit sensitive. You've got to know yourself this week, so I'm going to take that on. But no, over here, I'm bulletproof, so this would be better for me to do the presentation or the da-da-da. The cycles of the moon. So this is the divine feminine energy is, right, this is your inner child coming out to play, caring less. I cast this burden on the Christ within and I go free. This is also not allowing, do you love it? Scratching my nose, it's not allowing children to be the scapegoat 
of a toxic relationship because that's totally unfair to the child. And this is moving away from the mental habit of worry, doubt and fear because the Ace of Wands is here for April, for Divine Feminine. The Ace of Wands is a huge surge of power. So you've got to think, well, how am I going to use that? How and what, what do I want to create with this energy? And here's a little apology coming through <coughs> from Divine Masculine. I'm sorry. Allowing the past to have no power over you and letting it go because divine love keeps no record of wrongs. And here you are, justice is prevailing. Please keep your temper intact. Oh, thank you, Kelty Cross, for your beautiful donation on behalf of all of us. We God bless you and thank you. Um, so justice is underneath, right? So the karma has balanced in your twin flame. Got to keep nice, not let Jezebel antagonize you, right? It's none of your business. If your twin is with somebody else, then they're not cooked. They're not ready for you. Or So what can you do? You can't go over there into the matrix. You have to come back and go, how can I get brighter? Because I'm going to blast them with love. So we get the fire truck in and the big hose and, we'll and then watch them go up on the, do you love it? Blast them with love. So here, here you are. So the outcome is holding on, right? Holding on. Look at the heart. It's holding on to the divine love. So we're going to call in the Venus beings of light. And we ask now Venus beings of light. You say this out loud. Lady Venus. Sanat Kumera. I ask that you activate my soul star chakra and release the love of my soul deep into my being. Allowing your surroundings, right, to reflect your love. Getting peace that surpasses understanding. Aloha from Maui. I love Maui. Okay. Thank you, Heidi P. Love you. So what, what the Four of Pentacles is, is getting really grounded, getting in receptive mode, pulling back, and also um, getting out of any debt. Okay, so we say now we release the need for debt and we now release the pattern in our subconscious mind that has created this condition. We cast it out in the name of Jesus Christ. So the message, right, is to know that you are getting to your destination even though you've been distracted from not hearing your guidance. So it's like GPS in the car. Right, you've got to turn the radio off, which is the mind matrix. And you've also got to open your clairs. So we do that in Reiki level one and two. Open your clairs so that you can get your guidance because you're supersonic. You've got the kick-ass radar system. Nobody else has it. They never have. They've just put you down so they don't look so bad. So now you've got to own it. You've got to go, hang on, I've got Archangel Michael who has got, um, you know, legions of angels at his disposal, militant precision. We're going to call upon Archangel Michael to be um, your, what's it called, your security guard. So we ask for 24-hour, seven-day-a-week surveillance. I'm going to call in rot wheelers. I like laser beams and a bit of an electric fence, if you like. So what happens is when somebody stumbles at their fence, they can't come into your energy field to take from you. So their intention was to take from you, so then they fall down. So it's going to take everything you've got to not jump the fence, turn it off and say, sorry, I'm sorry. You're like, okay, well, now you know that if you come to take from me, that's what happens. But then you get to see who's giving to you and who's not. And it can break your heart because you think, wow, I thought that person was with me. So whoever's not for you is against you. So don't worry about being lonely. You'd rather be lonely and clear than have people around and be deflated, okay? So the union's coming because of your empress energy that you're bringing to the planet and the sun's shining on you. The next week is very, very powerful for not allowing any negative thoughts in control or delete. We've got the six of swords, which is peace that surpasses understanding and then receiving an apology. Because remember, the narcissist doesn't apologize. Never says they're sorry. So when you get that, don't roll your eyes like me. Go, 
right? You don't need an apology because you take everything to Jesus, but you're just acknowledging that that is releasing them. Forgiveness releases you. Anything else that we need to know? Okay, so they're saying don't worry about social media, right? How Jezebel can affect you is if you see a picture of your divine masculine or something else of the nah, uh, 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 Lucifer, right? Because it's all distraction and a lot of times it's not real, but it makes you react and then you're feeding the demons that have got permission. So we say no to that, we cast them out, we have God dominion over our soul, we call on the law of encroachment to release Jezebel from our twin flame and we bring the love of our soul deep into our being. We're also going to end with connecting to the fifth dimensional crystal grid of Gaia. What a powerful session. These are sessions now. So I ask for you to give a donation if you feel that it's helped you in any way and I thank everybody because you're helping the collective I'm bringing you your extensions here so please go to the PayPal me link below and give what you can to help us all so we're going to oh yeah activate your earth star chakra now right because you're the pillar receive their apology now oh thank you for your 99 cents a star I love you we're just going to call upon the Palladians because I'm a Blu-ray, as most of you are. And we say, galactic beings of the light, I call upon you now. I give you permission and ask to activate my earth star chakra and send a cord of light at the speed of light to Gaia's fifth dimensional crystal grid. I am now connected and I can feel the shift. Whoa. So when you say it, the vibration you create comes back to you and gives you messages through your clairs. So opening your clairs, not worrying about anything to do with unrequited love, drop it. Bad behavior, ignore it. Good behavior, we're rewarding it. Bringing love, not getting antagonized and into drama through trauma. So we're releasing all of it. I'm going to do one more thing. God said there's one more message. What's this? Even in Matthew 24, 24, for false messiahs and false prophets will appear and perform great signs and wonders to deceive, if possible, even the elect. And that's you. And that's why you need the power of the Holy Spirit. We're going to get a message here from your twin flame. For April. So we've got the sun, the ace of wands, the page of cups, right? Being divine, feminine, empress energy, you're bringing life force to this planet where it's dark it's not easy but it's powerful and it um the darkness cannot overcome it so you create the sword of light at holy 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 if you haven't subscribed there already you are an angel of light before you i surrender past and future all that matters is this moment my heart is transformed every time you are near and that's how I feel about you and this reading this afternoon. May God bless you in magical, wonderful ways. As we close, we're going to command an outrageous demonstration of love. So we're going to say big, deep breath. <coughs> I think I just ate a flea. <coughs> a fly. I command an outrageous demonstration of unconditional love today from my creator. Put your hands in the air and then go to receptive mode, Twin Flames, to help receive it. Say, Dear Father God, in Jesus' mighty name, help me open to receive your blessings, your miracles and your love. I love you. We ask this in the name of Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Please go to my subscriptions below. I'll put the links on. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for your donations. Give generously at my PayPal link if you haven't already. And I will see you very soon for Twin Flames for April. I love you. God bless you.